Hello everyone. Thought I'd show you a little bit of my laundry stockpile in my cellar. Let's go around. And there's some more up there. <laughs> there you go. I do have more laundry detergent and things up in my stockpile room. But this is where I've been bringing all of it for quite a while. Plenty of detergent and fabric sheets, fabric softener, all of that. Um, even some of those snuggle packs. I got tons of those I got for free with couponing. Um, just there you go. Now, what I want to talk about is when does a conspiracy become truth? A conspiracy is normally never proven to be true. And we're going to use an example of Alex Jones. First of all, I just find him extremely offensive. I don't, listening to him is like listening to nails on a chalkboard to me. But he started a vicious conspiracy about the Sandy Hook um, school shooting and said it wasn't true that there were actors and it wasn't true. And I put myself in the place of those parents. And he definitely should feel repercussions of this. And I hope that he loses everything he has. Because that's just one conspiracy that's tearing this country apart. I am going to say that if you believe something thoroughly you believe it you believe it you believe it you should still research it and make sure it's true just saying hey y'all have a great day hugs from a distance